I, I think I could probably come up with five. I don't want to sit here. I almost like, almost like to have to if write I it down to. and look at it. <laughs> she would, it'd be hard for her, I think, to come up with five things. <laughs> I really do. <laughs> Can we just do two? <laughs> <laughs> maybe maybe that's it. enough. That's yeah. enough. <laughs> okay, Bruce. Um, these are some of the things I love about you. Um, I love that you are a great provider for our family. That um, you make sure we're always taken care of. Um, Jim, I love about you that you're such an extrovert and you can talk to anybody um, forever. Taylor, I love when you smile and your eyes light up and you get your little wrinkles by your eyes. And I just, <laughs> I just love it because you can tell that you're, you're so happy and your eyes just beam. I love that. Mike. I love that you are honest. I love your integrity. I love how you are with our family. I love it that you know my love language, which is acts of service. Yeah. Um, you, every time I ask for something, you do it, and I think you have made that my love language. And I love how you love our kids, and I love how you love our grandkids, and I love how you, um, want to spend time with us more than anything else like you always are up for doing stuff like Chuck E. Cheese on a whim <laughs> um, and I love that you just take care of us and I just love you. I love that um, how you make me feel like I'm the only person in the whole world and that you just make me feel so good about myself and and just when I don't feel good about myself that you just remind me that I'm beautiful and God loves me and you love me and I just <laughs> I love that we're on the same page for our life goals and I really love that you pray for me and I just love how much you care about our family and how you're going to be the best dad to our little baby and I'm so excited to have 50 more kids with you. <laughs> You've heard that she wanted more kids, so it's true. <laughs> I just love you. I love you. Ah, <laughs> uh, Linda. Um, I love your um, singing. You sing a lot in the house. And I think I would miss that a lot. And I someday maybe, you know, that, that might happen. But um, I love that you sing a lot and, and that oh I enjoy gosh. that. Um, Kim, I love that you're pretty. Aww. I love that you take care of yourself. Jules, I love your nose. <laughs> um, let's see. I also like or love how you uh, uh, keep in touch with the kids and how you're always on top of what's going on with the kids and what we're doing. You know, because I could be lost and confused and you're always there keeping track of that. Hannah, I love that you are selfless, easily the most selfless person in the world. I love your uh, your ability to teach the kids the schoolwork. You know, you're a good teacher, and uh, way better than I would be. And I love that. Um, and I love how you love me unconditionally, even though I mess up all the time. Um, you, you encourage me more than anybody encourages me. Um, and the fact that you you uh, know where I struggle and um, you encourage me in that area um, and you know just an identity and stuff and you've always been the one to encourage me um, I love your personality you're spontaneous and you're funny and yeah uh, there's so many things you like to get out there and do if you can get past that shyness I guess I love how shy you are but then you actually get out and do it so um, but but no you really show be like what it means to submit um, and not that you know I, I rule over our house but I think you really really uh, know what it means to submit um, and not that you're under me but that you walk alongside me um, and I, I couldn't I couldn't do this with anybody else so I appreciate you and I love you yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm pregnant <laughs> <laughs>
It started pretty rough. Okay. I love you. I love you. <laughs>